Oh, I need to unplug my controller while I do. I keep doing this. Woo! God, it feels so good to be back. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor's got a machine gun. I forgot about that. Doctor also can't die. What was I doing before this? I forget. Ah. That's what we were doing. Because there's literally nothing else to do. Sotophenthesis. Oh. Sweet America. Hello again. Hi. This is President Eden. The Capital Wasteland. How did it come to this America? It was me. I did it. I set off the bomb. It was my fault. Sorry. To die. The answer is really quite simple. Incompetence. No, it was me. Incompetence at the highest echelons of power. Wait. We put our trust, our faith, in halfwits. I don't wonder. Wait. wait. Where's McCready? He should be at the front gate, right? Does he just kind of roam around? Oh boy, if that's the case, we're gonna be in for a ride. Stupidity. Rest assured, I will not make the mistakes of my predecessors. McCready, show up, or I'm gonna kill your ass in Fallout 4. What the fuck are you doing in here? This isn't even your fucking room. Get up, asshole. Look, I don't just let any son of a bitch into my town. I'm taking a risk making an exception for you. So you're welcome in my town. At least until you start screwing up. Once that bullshit starts, you're out on your own again. Boo hoo, you big baby. You're still a mungo, and I still don't like mungos. You want a party or something? You go pay some mungos to be your friends. And then they can talk all about how great you are. How's that? It's not safe, even for someone as brave as you. There's monsters back there. Yeah. It's the only way. The other door hasn't worked since before I was here. Computer's busted and not even Joe. If you're going to... But I... You sure about that? It's scary in there. Even I don't like going in there, and I'm really brave. Oh, come on. Every man for himself! Run! <laughs> you have a fucking gun, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, just, just follow me in. Wait, you're actually fine with me. Wait, why aren't... Help! These people Help! usually attack, what the fuck? Whatever. I know for a fact McCready usually attacks with that assault rifle. For some reason, he's not doing it. That's really odd. You know, we're about to enter possibly one of my favorite locations in this entire game. It's a really great location, I'll be honest. I like this location. I also kind of like Old Only, but I'm not about to visit that place. That, that's a death wish. Yeah, I thought I heard a frag bouquet. Dicks. Damn it! Um, why is there just a red tick mark? 
am I am I the enemy now? Hi. Wait, um, is that, are these, oh no, <laughs> this is so bad, oh, I hate these things so much, ah, this is so boring. I hate these things. I hate, I hate those fucking... There's another one for you. Ah! What? What? Oh, he's dead. Fucking mini nuke. Yes. Okay, what kind of enemy do you, what kind of enemies do you think are going to be guarding this? I'm going to guess there's going to be uh, one of those bullet sponges. Ah, no, no bullet sponge this time. Oh no, you know what? You know, you know what would suck? Uh, I just thought of this. What if Fox dies trying to get to the uh? To the geck. Yeah, this is gonna go over terribly. Well, Aha! I just want to see how he fares against these super mutants. Oh, yeah, there's one. Have fun with that fox. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna close that door. I should probably help him out, because this, this might end horribly. Um. Oh, never mind. He's, he's, he's a fucking meat shield. And again, so is he. So, we'll see how this turns out. Let's watch this fight. Damn, he won. <laughs> Fox has a shit ton of health, I guess. Nope, nope, blood. Finest blood you have to, to offer. None of that super mutant shit. Sorry, Fox. <laughs> mine. It's mine. Mine, 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 mine. Take it up. Mine. Fuck you. Fox is probably thinking, way to make me feel useless. This is I got the gack. Wait, what's this way? <gasps> it's a door. What's behind door number three?
Uh, what? Can you not? Can you not do that? Oh boy, I sure hope nothing bad happens! Soldier, make sure the Gek is secured aboard my Vertibird. Yes, sir. I'll have the text come down and remove it immediately, sir. You're certain he's unharmed? Yes, sir. He'll pass out shortly, but we can revive him. Excellent. Prepare him for transport immediately. Right away, sir. Hey, Dick. So. You're awake. Let's keep this nice and simple. You're going to tell me the code for that purifier, and you're going to tell me now. I'll tell you whatever you want. Please just don't hurt me. Now that's just what I wanted to hear. So what's the code? Very well. We'll just verify that now. Yes, please. This is Colonel Autumn. Are your men in place, soldier? Affirmative, sir. Standing by for code transmission. Your code is 704. Repeat. 704. Confirm and enter. Copy. 704. Stand by, sir. Entering code now. Negative, sir. The code's no good. <laughs> I just lost another man. <laughs> Why do you insist on making things difficult? Maybe I should start shooting. How much blood you think you can afford to lose before you tell me what I want to know? Colonel, I have need of you. <laughs> Fucking Mr. great, President, great writing. Ah. Uh... <laughs> yes, sir. Some great A script writing going on there. I was worried that that was bugged. Uh, my HUD's still bugged, though. That's good. That's great. That's that's fine. I, I, I love you. I like that. I mean, what? What you get for letting a serial killer loose. You deserve this. Attention to all Raven Rock personnel. Mm. Tasty. Maybe they're checking for Mad Cow. I don't know. <clears throat> Mad Brahmin? Hello. It's a real disease. It it plagues hun, hun, mil, mil hundreds. This is Colonel Autumn. Oh boy. Don't don't open that you door for me. To ignore the president's previous directive. Come on. The prisoner from Vault 101 <laughs> is to be shot on sight. I repeat. You know your men won't win, sight. right? 
This is an order. Come on. Yeah, you know your men won't win, right? I don't see why you did that. That was a terrible move on your end. Yeah, you shouldn't have done that, Autumn. There's a reason I named you Dick. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be going. I'm just gonna go this way then. Help me, I'm lost. What does this map say? That's not very helpful. Oh, is that what that's supposed to be? <clears throat> that's an iBot. Hi, Eddie. And that that's 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 a robo brain. Gotcha. You know, I should probably hurry up before the game crashes, because I feel like that's about to happen here soon. I just I just have that feeling. You. What are you doing here? I could be asking you the same thing. What are you doing here? Get out? Why on earth would I want to do that? I thought I I've killed you hard though. I've worked to fit in here. I've done everything they've asked <clears> of me. <throat> I'm not about to leave now when I finally have act. Of course. You've seen the kind of technology these people have. They want to help people. They want to change the wasteland. I couldn't pass up an opportunity to work in an environment like this. Look, it's not personal. Really, it's not. But Dr. Lee, she's scraping by. She's scavenging for parts in the wastes. The Enclave has everything it needs. They're light years ahead of anything Dr. Lee could accomplish. Working here is my best chance to help make the world a better place. I'm sorry you see it that way. You should go. There you go. Can you stop that? Can, can, can you shut your laser horn up, please? God, you guys are so annoying. I hate Gatling lasers. You too. I'm going to get my ass out of here now. Really? I blame this guy. I blame this dude for the reason why the base is self-destructing right now. I blame you. Hi. My friend. I knew you were my. Seen. I read about. I want. Hi, bot. Hi, bot. Hey, Enclave Radio is still playing. Sweet America. It Hello is. Again. Damn. This is President Eva. Huh. I'd like to have a chat. Oh. Is that what I think is it is? America. And no, not just on your radio. Right now, Enclave troops are patrolling the capital wasteland. These fine men and women, under the command of the stalwart Colonel Augustus Autumn, have one mission. The restoration gonna, well, okay, of wait. Peace and I'll drop that and well, let's um, hear from the man himself, shall we, America? I give I don't know. you I'm, Colonel Augustus. I've got way too much Autumn. shit right now. Um, you, well, clearly, but. <laughs> People of the capital Lord. wasteland. By now you have encountered enclave troops enclave. in your settlements. Settlements. When you see the enclave, you see the United States government. No. We are authorized to restore order and civility. Uh -huh. By any means necessary. Yeah. Just stay out of the way no. and let us do our job. Mm, no. Interfere with the enclave's mission, and you will be dealt with. You will be sacrificed to the great Very god much. Cthulhu. Another one. Yes. Yes. All you need is a little patience. A little faith. Until next time.
next time, this is John Henry Eaton signing off. Hey, shall win. You return. Shall I join you once? You are my. I'm with me, shall win. You are pivotal in this. I will not make the mistakes of my predecessors. I gotta wonder if I make Liberty Prime big, will he fire big, um, big missiles at people? Maybe. Congratulations. Hey, uh, Rothschild, you, you mind uh, getting out of my face? Armor. Wait. Oh. 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 This is yeah. Radio with your what? Host, me, President John Henry. Sharon, why are you looking at me like that? Here's a good idea. Oh Jesus Christ, that's a big Liberty Prime. <laughs> I want to see what small Sharon has to offer. Stop with the explosions, please. Fearless enclave soldiers are fortifying their positions at the great water purifier, bracing for an inevitable assault. Brotherhood of Steel, in their arrogance. I can't say I'm surprised. You and your ilk seem hell bent on destroying everything our government has worked to achieve. There's nothing to stop me from killing you this time. Let's end this. You're in, but this is the path you choose for yourself. No. Tell your father I said hello. Wait. Oh no. No, no, no. Ew. I wanted that suit. I'm going to reload. <laughs> I wanted that fucking suit. You again. There's no. No, no. Oh, that's better. That's much better. You can have uh, all these frag mines. Yeah. I'm not so upset about losing the uh, the minigun or the Gatling laser. I'm not so upset about that one. Matter of fact, can we, can we, can we please just get rid of? Well. That takes care of that. By now, the pride should be mopped. What Let's is wrong with your hair? Dr. Lee, it's Sarah Lyons. I'm in the control room. We're both here. What's going on? Fearless enclave soldiers are fortifying them. This is an unpleasant situation. I don't remember. As my employer. That's America. Stand now. A great nation once more threatens to crumble, to topple into the sea of lawlessness and despair that have ruled us all. <laughs> this is gonna be so bad. Uh, Mini Sharon has to, you know, push those buttons. I don't know if he can reach the control panel. <laughs> Sharon's taking his sweet time, don't worry. Sharon, I... Oh, never mind. I guess that's how that works.
Careful now, careful. Don't move too quickly. Everything's fine, you're safe. You're in the Citadel. I was starting to think you might never wake up, despite assurances to the contrary. I've been coming down here every day to see both you and my daughter. Right, I it's forgot Sabersaurus was in this mini box. Oh. What? Yes, yes. She's fine. Or she will be. I appreciate your concern for her, but really don't worry. You've been through enough. It's all right. You're safe now. You're in the Citadel. There the was some citadel. sort of energy spike as the purifier started. I got you a whole place at a saber source and ten packs. Unconscious and nice. brought here to the infirmary. I'm multitasking right now. Can't you tell? The two of you for days. Unprofessional of me, but I'm glad to see it's paid off. Yes, it did. We've been distributing the water as best we can. She and she and there she and she and she and she and she and problems, but Fuck. we're dealing Superconductor with it. Superconductor Tyranno. Without your assistance, this never would have been possible. We all owe both you and your father a great deal of thanks. Okay, yeah. The pack pulls are done. I got one super that was garbage, and I got three other cards that will help my Rex Raptor friend here. Um, back to the game at hand, I guess. <coughs> How long was I out? Just about two weeks. That red tick is still there. God damn. I just wanna, I just wanna check if, like, the armor despawned. If so, that's gonna be very disappointing. Wow, this game looks... Yeah, that's what I thought. The game was kind of looking like shit for a minute there. Um, shading seems really off. What the hell? Yep. Yikers. Oh no, whatever shall we do? Sorry, is that a Hellfire Soldier again? <laughs> nah, I think it despawned the armor. Um, oh, wait, wait a minute. Whoa. No, it didn't. Okay. That was a good move on my part now. I don't know where the... Or was it Fort Independence? I think that's what it is. I don't know where that is, but I'm going to go over there. Keep your head down, idiot. If you're going to get yourself killed out here, I don't want your co- Yeah, that's what they all say. Usually, I'm Defender and- Have you know I can survive stepping on a landmine? I've tested it. We call it- And before- You Okay. Back to stare at all the outcasts. Don't you have to get better to be sure? I unlock the store right now. Are you guys gonna, you know, hurt me? Ow. Or lockpick. I'm Protector Henry Kasdan. Nor You'd better believe it. <laughs> He's wearing the armor. That's great. There. Impacts, yes. Right, where's Sharon? Chev Wynn, where'd you go? Sharon was behind me, right? Hang on. I, I, I don't 
don't know where Sharon went. I just know that I think he bugged out. Sometimes companions, when you give them the command to follow you, they actually don't do it. And I think that's what happened. He just bugged out. Because, yeah, he's not, he's not anywhere near me. Um, Sharon, Sharon, Sharon. Yes, what is it? Very well. If it isn't our locals, you there. What exactly was that weapon I picked up in there? Uh, let me show you this beautiful, beautiful, terrible weapon. There's a reason. Yeah, if you uh, if you see here, it's called the Miss Launcher. It's a really shitty weapon, and I, uh, I, I don't like it, so not even worth that much. I'm tempted to drop it or store it somewhere. You know, it's not like uh, this weapon here, which is fun. So, yeah, I'm done. Um, I think next part I should just work on Broken Steel because... Broken Steel is a, um, I mean, I'm done with the main story now, technically, but Broken Steel can be considered part of the main story, because, yeah, I'm, I'm here, aren't I? Um, yeah, I don't know how to end videos, bye.